So hi guys, in this video I'll be telling you how to dual boot Cute Fish OS with Windows 10 or 11 or 11 7. So the prerequisites are you need to download the Cute Fish OS ISO and Rufferus and need a 8 GB pen drive stick free of space and now you can once these both files are downloaded you can open Rufferus you can open it and drag and drop the Cute Fish ISO into your Rufferus and click on start ok and all data will be wiped out so have a backup once that is done you can click on ok now deleting partitions and installing it so it's going to take some time now let's shrink the partitions for our installation now well i have already shrinked a hundred gb of space from my hard drive so how to shrink let me tell you if you want to shrink from your hard drive you can right click it you can click on shrink volume and wait for this to load well, when you can see a screen like this that means what you need to do is enter the amount of size you want to shrink in case in my case i had shrinked uh, 100 gb so i'll be entering 100 gb i won't be i wouldn't be shrinking it since i've already shrinked mine so when you enter your size and click on enter you'll be seeing something like this unallocated and the size you had shrinked once you have shrinked it you can close this and wait for your image to get flashed so once the flashing is done it says ready you can close this and close all your running apps and well now you can shut down your pc wait for your pc to get shut down now once your PC is shut down, power it on again and keep on pressing F2 or any other key provided by your manufacturer until your laptop boots into BIOS. So well my BIOS is booted, now you should have your pen drive plugged in and you can press F8 for boot menu and select your pen drive right there and click on enter so that you'll be seeing the Linux installation screen now as you can see if you want to try Cute, cute fish OS without installing you'll directly go to the cute fish OS without installing and if you click on install cute fish OS you can directly install cute fish OS both are okay I'm gonna click on install cute fish OS so well we have arrived with the setup screen and the booting into the setup is gonna take you more than for five minutes so you'll need to wait for that as for me it took five minutes so now click on continue with, the, with your preferred language and wait for it. Every time you click on continue, it's going to take a very long time. So you need to wait for that. And now connect to your internet. So well, now you need to select these. If you want to install third party softwares for graphic and hardware and Wi-Fi driver. So in case you have a GPU and this is going to install the driver automatically. So if you click on this, your drivers will get automatically installed. So click on this and click on continue. Click on something else and click on continue again. And this is the most important part of the video. You'll need to be selecting your drives for, I mean, the hard drive you just shrinked. So now let's select the hard drive. And this is the hard drive which is shrinked 100 GB. So click on plus, shrink 8 GB of swap. And here you need to select swap area and select everything is proper. Now you can click on OK. Now a swap area is created and go to this free space again. Now select 9 GB. That is 9000 MB and select ext4 journaling file system and select home. Now click on OK again. Now click on now click on the go to the free space again and this is 90 GB and select ext4 journaling file system and just select the slash. So this is the root partition where all your files will be stored. 
and the pa partition we created before was the home partition where all of the files will be stored and swap area as a virtual memory so once all three are created we can click on install now and apply changes to disk if everything is proper you can do it continue so well my pc has booted now let me sign in so this isn't how your start menu will look like you can customize it how much ever you want and Kufi show is basically looks like mac os let me just show you when it boots and well this is how the Kufi show looks like and as you can see it looks like completely like mac os so this is the settings and look at that opening and closing so it's basically like a mac opening is also going to look so smooth and there are no short keys, shortcut keys set yet so you need to set them manually so they have good animations in this like just like the mac overs and there can be a lot of customization in this for showers but it's not yet fully stable for daily usage and not many softwares are supported in this and this is just a developing over so it's going to take some time for the OS to get fully developed so we have to wait for that now you can be accessing your other drives like in windows you had your hard drive you can be accessing that right here as you can see this is my hard drive in my windows and i'm able to access it so you don't be having a problem of that you can be transferring files between windows and linux that is possible completely and this is on how to install cube shows for your pc and if this worked for you, please like, share and subscribe. Bye.